Hello! In this tutorial I'm going to show you how to download and set up your own local commands on your local environment running from Lamina Starter Kit page. So, what is Lamina Starter Kit exactly? Well, it's a set of tools to generate a code for your new features. For instance, users app, forms, login registration or CRUD operation. So, like we said before in our previous video, we have two ways of actually running it. So in this video we're going to show how to run it locally. So we will create a copy of the GitHub repository by including this new project into our Laminas MVC. If you don't have Laminas MVC already set up on your local environment running on your XAMPP, like we have over here, Laminas MVC public. Then you want to have a look at the previous video, which we covered setting up a Laminas MVC skeleton application. So, how are you going to do it? Uh, it's quite simple. Uh, Laminas Starter Kit actually have a GitHub link to the repository which we'll be using. So, in our case, it's uh, tvx1988 laminas CLE commands. To include it into our project, we just need to copy this one line of code of Composer Require. Uh, we then open a Exam control panel and then we click on the shell button. Um, in here, we need to make sure that we are navigating to the htdocs and laminas mvc folder. Now we can just paste the contents and press enter. Make sure you include require dash dash dev, which means that this dependency package would only be available when you're running a local environment and not on the production. Um, this will take a while, so we'll do a cut and we'll get back when it's finished. Right, once the package would be downloaded, right, you can directly call commands in this window. How to do it? Let's uh, go back to Lambda CLE commands with a uh, GitHub repository and below there is a setup procedure. So we first need to copy this lines of code and navigate back to config, autoload and let's change the local PHP .dist to just local PHP. Let's open the file. Let's paste the new array contents. Right, job done. The Lamina CLE commands are now fully configured. What does it mean? We can now go back to the GitHub page and if we're using Windows, we'll use a vendor bin laminas.bat with uh, commands params and the command name. And if we are on Linux or a Mac, we just do a laminas without dot bat. So let's do a sample check of creating a sample controller. Let's open the shell. Let's make some room. Let's paste the command. Um, and we're going to change the name to sample name. Uh, let's keep module name by the default. Um, and let's keep action one, action two as the actions from, from our controller control, from our controller. Let's press now enter. That's it. We just generated a new controller inside of the new created module name. So let's now open the Lamina MVC file structure 
let's go to module module name src controller sample name controller php right let's open it and here it is action one action two actions self-generated with an abstract action controller in place so that's it I'll post all the links in the description below and thank you for listening